dirt track racing, you have to do something that would normally scare the shit out of you. You go down the straightaway and you throw it into the corner as hard as you possibly can. And if you don't die, then the next straightaway you put it in even harder. At times, I probably have thought, well, Ken, maybe, you know, you're 76 years old. When do you think you should quit? I can't hear as good as I used to, and I can't see as good as I used to. I'm certainly not as fast now as I was when I was 20. I always thought when I got old, my wife would take care of me, but it didn't turn out that way. My wife has progressive dementia. Some of my family want me to put her in a home. If I put her in a home, she'd be there two days and she wouldn't know me. And I can't do that. I leave her home on race night. That's the only time I'm away from her. Racing. This has always been my real passion, racing. My wife, she nursed our children in the grandstands. I've won over 250 main events, seven track championships. It's the greatest feeling in the world. My dad, he's won races my whole life. He's had a lot of friends who used to race that stopped racing. and. Most of them have passed away. If so, I want to try to do it as long as he's able to, even if we have to get him up there in a wheelchair. got the biggest problem in the world waiting for you when you get out. When you're racing, you give it 100% of your concentration. You forget about everything. I feel young on a race, like I don't feel old. Once you get in the car, you just don't feel old.